this lecture, I'll give you the information you need to get the Pomsky you've always wanted. First, here are some things to consider when looking for a Pomsky to make sure that he or she is a good fit for you and your lifestyle. Since the Pomsky is a relatively new designer breed, they've only been on the scene since 2012, we really don't know everything there is to know about them as of yet, such as their full lifespan or any health issues that they might be subjected to. But we can assume that they can adopt the parent Husky and Pomeranian health traits. Also, they can be a handful when it comes to grooming, so that's good to keep in mind, especially keeping the shedding under control. Some Pomskis won't shed as much and others will shed more. And Pomskis have high energy levels and they need lots of attention, affection, and care. They can be stubborn and sometimes harder to train than other breeds. But on the plus side, they are extremely intelligent. And we don't yet know their ranking in intelligence compared to other breeds, but some suggest that they can give the Border Collie, which is recognized as the smartest dog breed, a run for his money. Pomskis also are very protective of family, and they make great watchdogs, but that can lead to them barking every time someone approaches you. Most dog owners would probably like their dog to be more behaved when in a non-threatening condition, so the barking will have to be addressed in their training sessions. There's a possibility that they can acquire behavioral issues such as small dog syndrome. Small dog syndrome is a term which means that the dog can be a bit on the yappy side, sometimes difficult or somewhat of a prima donna. And actually a good many little dogs do exhibit those types of behavior, but it's not because of their breed or size. It's more of a learned set of behaviors. So if properly trained, you can avoid all that and have a well-behaved Pomsky. Another thing to consider is they're expensive. They range in price from $1,000 up to $6,000, depending on the size and their markings. Usually the smaller ones, the ones that look more like Huskies, those tend to fetch on the higher end of that scale. And they can range in weight from 10 pounds to 35 pounds, so it's not always certain how big they'll be until they're fully grown. If you're wanting a lap dog under 15 pounds, many times it will turn out to be that, but sometimes it can get to the other end of that estimate and reach the 35 pound mark. But despite all those things to consider, the Pomsky is still one of the fastest growing designer dog breeds as of yet and certainly ranks up there as one of the cutest and most playful. They're also recognized by the Dog Registry of America. And there are also two official organizations that promote this new mixed breed, the International Pomsky Association and the Pomsky Club of America. With all that being said, let's now see how to go about getting one. 